Okay, so basically, this is just a little late night thought on my brain. Um, so let's get real. It's really weird growing up suicidal and then being an adult. Like one day you wake up and you're like, wow, I'm just here. And that, it, it's weird. Like, I don't know how to explain the feeling because realistically, like, in the back of your head for so long, and, like, my little backstory was, like, I was bullied a lot, blah, 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 the whole deaf thing, I didn't know how to speak. But that idea of suicide was there. And then out of nowhere, you know, things got better, and I learned how to cope better. But... The idea of suicide was still, it's still there. Like, I'm not saying this is any sort of thing you need to worry about. It's more like, like some days you slip, you know? And the days that you really slip, those are the days that, you know, you wake up and you realize, I'm gonna live. What do I do now? And that, I don't even know how to explain that. Like, what do I do now? Like, for so long, it was like, I'm not going to make it to this age. I'm not going to make it to that age. I'm not going to make it, you know, 21. I'm not going to make it to this. And now, I've surpassed everything. And I have a lot of ambition. I really do. It's just sometimes, I can't find the motivation to explore that ambition. And my brain runs at a thousand miles a second. And I can never figure out... Like, what am I doing? And that's really weird for all the kids that grew up. Thinking, you know, here's... The way for this thing gets hard, like Benito, and then coming to a place where you realize that's not the option. What do I do now? That's a weird feeling.